I was a big fan of Harvest Moon when it came out on the GameCube. My future wife and I spent way more time than we should have playing it instead of studying in college. When Stardew Valley first came out, it piqued my interest. Maybe it could scratch the same itch. But I was busy at the time, so I put it off until this year when it was on sale. I immediately loved the trip back to the SNES era graphics and the love and care that Concerned Ape obviously put into the game. As I advanced in the game, each new level of skills brought new fun to the game. It's pretty easy to see why he has such a dedicated fan base on his subreddit. I will say, I'm a little surprised when I see people on the subreddit who have farms that are way past year 3. There's definitely a lot to do in Stardew Valley, but the biggest reason I haven't finished, you know, getting to the end of year 2, is because I've reached a point where essentially I have infinite money and nothing else I truly want to buy. It's the same thing that ended up killing Harvest Moon for my wife. Now I do understand the replayability factor, there are many reasons for that, including the fact that there's 4 or 5 different maps which require different farm strategies. I hope sometime in 2020 to finish the game, and then maybe later in 2020 to start a new farm. To be honest, I completely forgot I had played any single player games for Civ 6. I thought it was all going to be multiplayer turns. Yet in this year I played as Sonduck, Washington, Poundmaker, and Coupe. And yes, I played a ton of multiplayer games. In the aftermath of EA screwing up Max's classic SimCity, I checked out Cities XL. It was alright, and I had some fun with it. But soon after, I started hearing that, that wasn't the game you want to be playing. You want to be playing Cities Skylines. Recently, it was available as part of a humble bundle, so I installed it, and I got re addicted to city building and city running. I started off the year very frustrated because something had changed. I don't know if it was in Spelunky, Dawn, Windows, or the Nvidia drivers, but it became impossible to record a game session. Then, somehow, I just had the idea to switch to recording the screen instead of the game, and that seemed to make the encoder happy. Spelunky was back on, and the kids got even more into it than they had been the previous year. Hey guys, welcome to Extra Life 2020 campaign. Once again, I'm going to be raising money for Johns Hopkins Children's Center. Um, I've been doing this for a few years now, but maybe you're new to my channel, new to um, see me raise money for Johns Hopkins. Um, I'm doing it because they helped save uh, my oldest daughter's life uh, when she was first born and then again when she was two. Um, she had two really life-saving operations. Uh, and also, uh, my twins were born in a hospital affiliated with Johns Hopkins. So it means so much to me to raise money to help other kids that really need their services. So. Um, if you can, just donate. Any amount helps. Um, anything from you know a recurring small donation all the way up to you know 25, 50, 100, anything, anything, any amount makes a difference. And so I ask you to help, um, donate, and and help out, and also enjoy whatever I'm about to play next. I was a big fan of Harvest Moon when it came out on the GameCube. My future wife and I spent way more time than we should have playing it instead of studying in college. When Stardew Valley first came out, it piqued my interest. Maybe it could scratch the same itch. But I was busy at the time, so I put it off until this year when it was on sale. I immediately loved the trip back to the SNES era graphics and the love and care that Concerned Ape obviously put into the game. As I advanced in the game, each new level of skills brought new fun to the game. It's pretty easy to see why he has such a dedicated fan base on his subreddit. I will say, I'm a little surprised when I see people on the subreddit who have farms that are way past year 3. There's definitely a lot to do in Stardew Valley, but the biggest reason I haven't finished, you know, getting to the end of year 2, is because I've reached a point where essentially I have infinite money and nothing else I truly want to buy. It's time for Eric Plays The Witcher 2.
episode five. Hey guys, how's it going? Here to see what happens with The Witcher. This is going to be my last live stream for a bit, I imagine. Um, been taking advantage of the wife being out of town for a little bit, and um, so working on live streaming. Uh, however, um, you'll be able to continue watching my adventures with Geralt um, on my YouTube channel. Um, I believe I've got a link to that somewhere here on my Twitch page. Uh, but if not, I'm DJ Otaku4. Can't believe there are three others on YouTube. Um, so here I am. I had to find Ostmark or talk to Cedric. So let's start off by taking a quick look in here. Alright, so it's an herb that grows underground in damp places. I think. <coughs> My Geralt would not just waste time looking in dank places. He would go ask Cedric. Um, and so that's what I'm going to do. The reason I'm going to do it is because... I don't want to waste time. There's only so much video game time in a day. And um, I don't want to spend it looking for this stupid thing, right? So that's what Geralt's going to do. That said, you know, I tend to get really lost in these open world games. Um, you know, uh, I didn't live stream um, Assassin's Creed uh, when I played that for the first time because um, I was uh, doing it on PlayStation 3 and at the time, well first of all at the time I didn't live stream but um, or record Let's Plays. So that's where the ogre lives. Um, but, but take that aside um, my point being, I would constantly get lost, like, my, um, what was my guy's name, and what's your guy's name in that game, um, I forget what the assassin's name was in the, uh, whatchamacallit, in the, uh, the first game where you're the, uh, Syrian guy, but, but mine was just constantly getting lost, like, like, if you're role-playing as him, he just doesn't know his way out of a paper bag, you know? Um, and so, I'm kind of used to that. As you can see right now, I'm kind of lost now that I'm not following Trissa around about where to go. And this map kind of doesn't give me the right information that I need in terms of avoiding areas that are going to get me stuck. And that's kind of annoying. So my girl kind of runs around like an idiot. Or at least more of an idiot than I would imagine he does on the uh, Netflix show. There's the troll. I think I'm supposed to talk to someone before I deal with the troll rather than trying to kill him, so that's what I'll do. Uh, I seem to have generally found the right way. I'm guessing that this orange line on the top is pointing me towards... Um, Cedric. Uh, did I research this? I probably did. I think this is where the bandits were. Alright, so... Let's see. They come from this direction. Hmm. Um, I thought I had moved my chat stuff so it's out of the way from the in-world gooeys. I don't know why it moved back. Let's move this to here, so it's not on top of the map and the quest items. Let's see if that stays when I get back to there. We go. All right. Let me get me saving there. All right.
And so Geralt's running around. I think I'm almost back. Just on those fires over there. Alright. Oh, something's over here. Yeah, Cedric. Alright. Okay. Make my way the last mile to Cedric. Given how hard it was just to get to Triss. It's funny, this um, trail they've made kind of um, makes me feel the way I felt when I was hiking in um, the Redwood Forests in California. Kind of this way, but what the bloody hell is this? Odd. Alright, uh, okay, shoot, where am I supposed to go? Did I get myself all twisted up again? I believe that I did. I. Funny how. Later, if I have to find some weird ass looking graves, I know where to look. Yeah, at least I'm getting some more potion stuff, although, if I end up burdened again, that'll be annoying. Alright. So clearly. Not that way. Maybe this way. Uh, it seems to be a dead end. Whereas I feel like that should be where I'm headed, right? Let me see what's over there. That's where those creepy graves are. Or whatever those things are. Whatever these things are, I guess. Hmm. Finally, I could just jump down here. Why is Geralt being such a doofus? Alright, let's see if I backtrack enough to find my way to over there. Maybe this way? Yep, I remember this stream. Plus it says full flourish near flotsam. Alright, cool. Well, I found Cedric before I found any herbs, so... Alright. So I'll go talk to him then. Love it then. That was a weird sidestep when you did there. It'll be interesting when I reach the point in the game where I've got so much money I can afford to pay for Geralt to get a haircut. Not caring too much weight now. Walk slowly, because all these herbs are weighing you down. Hello. Slowly, slowly towards Cedric. Here he is. What's up, Cedric? Cedric, I need some Ostmark. It's a rare variety of moss, grows underground. I know it. There are some caves to the south, deep in the woods. If Ostmark grows anywhere in the area, it will be there. <coughs> Elven ruin. Okay. I guess I'll follow him. Doop, 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 doop. I wonder if I craft some potions. Will that help me out? Two. Of, I'm off by one. Yeah, you're kidding me. All right, let's see. Uh, let's see. Let's see my character abilities. Uh. Meditate. Some mixtures. Brock. Helps me crit. Brown oil. Increases bleeding. Cat. Alright, let's do some cat. Let's do. Let's do four cats, because we're about to go into some ruins. Alright. Has that worked? Or is uh, this stuff uh, is mess? Alright, let's see. 
All right, mass is conserved. That did not help. All right. Um, all right, then. All right, don't think I need to rake. There we go. That'll give me a little bit further along. Alright, so we go J. <laughs> I like how it changes there. Okay, so, um, oh, okay, so this is what gets the tag, I see. Alright, so troll of trouble. Alright, let me talk to the elder before I head into... Why two swords? Any work for a witcher? Enough work for three. <laughs> We're poor folk. I'm sure we can work something out. Ye best go to Flotsam Town Square near the inn. There are notices on the board there. Just leave the troll be, please, no matter what the townsfolk say. I heard you don't want to get rid of the troll. Who'll maintain the bridge when he's gone? Hire some people. Know the cost of a craftsman these days. <laughs> that idiot troll looks after the bridge for petty tolls, more or less. The bridge is in ruins and the troll's robbing people. Aye, it's because he's hit the bottle. If you could help him stop boozing. I'm a witcher, not a nanny. <laughs> I'll pay you well. How much? A hundred orens. Two hundred. You're costly, but what the hell. Let him see I place the village's welfare above all else. Right. Cool. Right. Today I'll tell ye how Lobenden came to be. Mm. A long time ago our forefathers... Watch this, this guy soul. talk a little bit. The king granted them land on the condition they clear the forest. Back then, like now, the wilderness was a dark, dreadful place. But our forefathers wanted to settle here back... That's what people did before Netflix. They nights on their riverboat. From the deck they could hear the old man and the howling of werewolves. <laughs> During the day, they tried to clear the forest with fire and axe. The trees, however, were too large and too tough for a Dernian steel. And the forest responded to fire by sending ever deadlier nightmares from its depths. A priestess came here with the settlers. A wise woman who finds some weird padding for the guys. That's cool. I like this. This adds some character to the world. Never submit to man. The priestess oh. led the men deep into the forest and showed them the altar of the old god Vayan Don't Mattis. know that I've the strength to work today. They all understood this land Why would never belong to them. But they could only settle its edge. Now, now that I know Our forefathers what to do to, uh... Mattis ...and offered him sacrifice. He protected them from the forest and gave them the river rich and To, uh... They posted poles in the forest to forever mark the boundary between the human... To mark a quest, that's the thing I'm going towards. Now I can maybe do some of the other quests that I was having trouble with, like the merchants on the riverfront. Unless I did that already. Contract. Hmm. I wonder where would I see that? Characters, monsters, monsters. 
can I read my books? Books, books, books. I know I have some. Alright, well, let's go to the Trolls Lair. Right, that's the one I've got highlighted. Yep. Okay. So we'll do that. Why does he need two swords? And then once we're in the woods, then we'll worry about uh we'll worry about uh getting the stuff from the forest. Alright, let's see, let me go this way. Back out through here, basically back to where I was. But I did have to get out this way in order for the guy to tell me to go back, talk to the guy, to find out about the, the orc. It's funny. Oh, sh this thing again. How many more can there be? Is this another Indra it's an Indrega, but I'm not I'm not getting my stuff, I think, until I read a book about it? I'm not hundred percent sure. Sometimes these things can be a little finicky. Alright, I'm not sure if I need to be under the bridge. I seem to be on top of where I need to be. Well, trolls do traditionally live under bridges, right? So Apparently there was some kind of great civilization that used to be here. They had these giant statues. Mm. Oh, nothing around here to do. Alright, and uh, right. Here I should find a troll, I guess. Oh there he is. No. No what? No passage. <laughs> Give vodka you passage. <laughs> this guy's Russian. <laughs> Do I look like an innkeeper to you? No vodka, no passage. Wait, wait, don't eat me, dude. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Ow. No, dude. Stop. Cut it out. Why? Ow. I'm not supposed to be killing this troll. Maybe that's enough. enough to make him stop. Don't hit! I'd be good! You're drunk. Vodka good? Head hurt, I. But no pain in brain. Brain pain always comes with a reason. They kill my woman. She good. She cooked meat. Who killed her? Don't know. Me sit on bridge. Go home. No meat smell. Woman dead. Had no head. Guts to drink. In can't go. People that kill. But guts to drink. If I find your woman's murderers, will you put aside the booze? You no find none. We'll see. I've got friends here. I'll talk to them. All right. Gotta find out what happened to the she troll. Alright, so I'll take care of that later. Now it's time for. Oops, what happened here? Let me see. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> That's funny. I like that. That's very cool. Alright, so let's do Ostmark now. <coughs> and then in the Claws of Madness while I'm in the forest. Alright. Um, so he's going to sit there. Did I pick my new thing? Oh, I did. Okay. So let's go map. I go off this way. So maybe go back to the river and follow it south? That seems like the most logical thing to do. I'll be up, Gerald. Alright, here we go. Hmm. Interesting. 
Maybe that's where I fought the monster, but... Alright, so we're gonna go up... Towards the river. This way, yep. Yeah. No, wait, let me see where I am on the map. I may have gone too far. Nope, not quite yet. Okay. Oh, man. Freaking shoulders. Try to sit up straight. Hopefully it doesn't put me too far from the mic. Alright, so we'll go up this way. Maybe over here. Alright, I found the river. I want to follow the river as much as it'll let me. Okay, game just auto saved. Alright, some bad guys here. Oh, take out my sword ahead of time. Come on, man. Guess that. Alright, cool. I got some knowledge. Attributes in the character development panel. Okay. All right, so. Go here now. Neckers, right? Neckers, 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 neckers. Necker. Okay. Maybe I need to get to three or three. Somewhat lost track of where I was going. Let's see. Map. Alright, keep following the river. More monsters somewhere. Hey there. Implies these aren't simply monsters. That's some kind of culture, you know. Out of them out here. No wonder there was a contract. Oh, lost my combo, I imagine. Yeah, I'm kicking butt though. All right. Oh, more of them over there? Nope. There's some elves or something over there. Switch to this sword. Oh boy, things just got epic as hell. Where are you? Wonder how many more will turn up. Oh boy. I figured I would, it would be. Alright. Alright, I'm here. Oh, search. Got a bunch of swords I should hopefully be able to sell. Alright, let's see here. Alright, let's see the Sword of the Blue Mountain. Alright, let's go swords. 
8 to 10, 8 to 10, 8 to 10. Alright, they're not that awesome, but I would like some money. So, let's see. I should be practically on top of where I need to be. I'm getting rained on. Alright, so I'm in a cave. I imagine there's going to be more bad guys here. But, really quickly, looks like I've got a talent. Alright. Throw daggers, huh? Bigger regeneration. Arrow redirection. Pairing. Vitality. I think I want more health. I believe that's what vitality is. Alright. Yep. Now I have to regenerate that extra health. Oh, I thought I was about to be in a uh, cutscene. Since I'm not actually, actually in the woods, where I think the insane asylum is, um, I'm going to go to the town and sell the swords before I try to do the insane asylum quest. Hoping this thing's leading me in the right direction. Okay. There's gotta be some bad guys or something coming, I imagine. I hear something. No, 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 take it out, take it out. Like crazy time, man. Okay. This make me slow to attack to, or what? Let's see. But I eventually reach a limit where I can't take anything else. What the heck is a necker doing with cloth? Also, how much over and um, way over encumbered, but whatever. As long as it's not going to start hurting me or something. Alright, if I wasn't in easy mode, this might be a bad thing, but I seem to be doing alright. he otherwise might. We also have finally reached the limits of what he's willing to pick up from these corpses. I gotta go this way. Oh, darn it, I need these guys. Hello. Watch me like, why is that guy moving so slowly? Well, because he's over encumbered, that's why. Q. Okay, Q. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, she can teleport me out of here after I find this is kind of annoying, especially at this weight, but. I really want to sell that stuff. Do, 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 do. Eh, the hair's alright. It's not doing as badly as it was in the first Witcher game. Hello, dude. What the? Greater. Wow. Oh my god. Out for that. Wait, I'm guessing that's what I need over there, right? Better freaking be. 
Yep. Okay, yeah. taking out my frustration on the off smirk. Alright. Head back to town. Very, very slowly. Ah, oh, crap. Did I go the wrong way already? went straight so it shouldn't be too bad. Hopefully I'm going the right way. Hey bad guy, what's up? Hey, bad guy from way, way out there. Right. Oh, I did end it. Corpses I killed before, so that tells me I'm going the right way. Right, until it stops letting me take stuff. I'm already over encumbered, so I might as well. Hopefully I can find a chest or something at some point. This is getting ridiculous. Hey, what's up, dude? Shit, you stink. Alright. I don't remember. Oh, yeah, I do remember crossing this. Almost there. I think I'll watch out for the squid tail again. Saves. That's probably a good sign. All right, here we are. I'll leave this sword for now, I guess. Because I get attacked again by some animals, monsters, whatever. All right. Cool. 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 Set a waypoint. I wish I really, really wish I could. Well, I seem to be <coughs> facing the right general direction, so just once I reach the river, follow the river, fight any bad guys. Oh, oh why is the music starting? I just swung at a branch. Oh, 
Oh, scary dude. Alright, I see another guy hiding back there, another necker or something. the right way? Okay, good. Whoa. There's dust everywhere. I get to town, this guy's a tech. Almost at town. I think I lost his uh, attention. Which kind of goes really well with the uh, Game Maker's Toolkit uh, stealth episode I was watching today about how stealth is implemented and all that type of stuff. Is it getting darker or is it just the place I'm at? Like, did it become nighttime and I wasn't paying attention? I guess it did. I'm supposed to see that guy in the evening. I'm used to just having to meditate to change the time. What are these guys waiting for over here? It's like a line or something. Oops, sorry. Yeah, it'd be funny if that started a fight. I didn't mean it to. Hello. I guess they're guarding. Alright. What the? Who's this guy? Oh, it's Cedric. I have some swords for you. Clubs. <laughs> I need two axes. I can move again. Alright. So I think I'm supposed to talk to this guy. And then maybe my friends. I thought it was not too late to talk to him. I think those guards are asleep at their posts. I'm stuck somehow, some kind of... Can't walk over a piece of wood, Geralt. Oh, sometimes games be games, right? Lads, I was thinking about what? I feel like I shouldn't have heard that quite so well. I'm taking your pouch. Or your pouch and your life. What did he say? He said there's a third option. And his hand inched towards his knife. <laughs> what then? He got a bolt in the back. Too bad he turned out to be poor. Mm. The poor ones are always uppity. Where's his residence? Why can't I go there? Oh, back there. There we go. Or 
around this way, I guess. No, nope, guess not. Alright, so this is the way we came into town. Let's see, how would I get to his house? <coughs> guess go all the way around. That prick Lorino <laughs> turned his nose up, eh? Ha! You'd think he was faultist himself, there we go. parading among his lessons. What? We made the deal. True it's enough. too late, I guess. Sometimes you just gotta... What? The Commandant wanted to see me. Leave your weapon here. Guard it with care. It's very valuable. Wait, Wolf. I need to talk to the Commandant too. You going inside or not? Listen, friend. I'm an officer and you're a runt. Mm. And when I say jump, you will not only... Come on, Roach. Mm. Oh, if these cunts, Laredo can protect the port from a drunk lumberjack, yep. let alone Yorbeth. That's true. He succeeds. A ballista. The bastard's got a ballista. You know the power of this <coughs> weapon. Yes, I saw it up there before when we came in. Its arms strengthened with bronze plates and strung with horsehair. It can propel heavy bolts up to a mile away. Yeah, an experienced crew can release two bolts each minute, but it can't hit the same spot twice because it recoils and shifts. This sounds like an as-you-know conversation. Where did you learn about Ballista? I the knew someone prologue. Who knew a bit about them. In Unimportant. The we need to damage Protest. it if we don't want to be at Laredo's mercy. They're all drunk here now. I'll provoke the guard. Relax, Roach. I don't want to fight this rebel Seems again. Seems like a bad idea. As long idea. as that weapon's operational, no one will sail this section of the Pontar without Laredo's express permission. I'll handle this. Go have a drink. Nothing better than a fireside. Oh my face. god, why am I on fire? What's happening? Two big shots arrive. <laughs> right okay, but I wanted to do this one. Luckily, he hasn't realized that. It all. Did True. you hear? Come Two here, big lad. shots arrive. Laredo's busy with that witch, Sheila. Come back later. Geralt, let's wait downstairs in the yard. Okay. Haven't had this good a time in ages. That's true. What are they, this one. these guys doing? <laughs> oh, they're eating. Yes. Do we wait until the honorable lady is done with the venerable hick? <laughs> Waste of time. Looks like a good number of Flotsam's town watchmen are here. We should look around. Did you see that <coughs> arbalist behind the house? I'll get his attention. Give him something to think about. Why don't you find out what they're guarding so closely? My apologies, gentlemen. I could not help overhearing your conversation. Hmm. What do you want? In point of fact, it's a matter for the Witcher. I have an offer. An offer? Interesting. I suspect you did not come to Flotsam for pleasure alone. You suspect right. No, this place is amazing. Do you know amazing. about the monster in the river? Yes, I do. Might have heard something. I expect someone will hire you to deal with it sooner or later. Thus, I presume that... Stop presuming, expecting, and concluding. Just tell me what you want. Our honored host is in possession of part of a trap, built especially for the beast in question. Go on. Around back, there's a storage area where Laredo keeps the treasures he confiscates from merchants and travelers. There are heaps of things out there. I feel like there. I did this out of order. Let me guess. You know exactly where I need to look. Precisely. I saw Laredo's men carrying the contraption across the garden in a crate. They placed it on a platform by the wall, beyond which lies the craftsman's district. Why are you telling me? Why? We need to be rid of the beast as soon as possible. Or maybe he's trying Good to luck. blackmail me. All right, I'll distract the guard. You sneak behind the house. Brilliant as ever. You've had your song. Care for some real diversion? Hmm. Soldier, report to me immediately. Doop -doop 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 -doop. What do you want? Mm. 
Stealth game. He's taking a piss. Also, gotta pick these herbs. All right, gotta get through this door. It's locked. Maybe he's got the keys. Maybe I'm too close to him to get keys. Uh, this way? No. Okay, it's locked. Um, let's see. Z. Okay, back here might be something I need, maybe. Oh boy, I kicked it. It's a bucket. In Flotsam, we cut the hands off thieves. I was looking for the privy. You're lucky the Commandant wants to see you. Come on! Damn. Commandant, sir. We caught the witcher sneaking around the garden. Bring him in and leave. Hmm. Yes, sir. We were just discussing a certain matter. You here on business, too? The Commandant wanted to see me. In that case, I shall leave you to it. Finally! They didn't want to let me in while the sorceress was here. Did you see her? Made up like a whore on parade day. They think they can do anything, those sorceresses. <coughs> I heard what happened in Tamaria. You know your name's on a warrant. Yes, they do. It's unfortunate. Though nothing that should impede our dealings. Great. See, I'm the law around here. And the law needs to know what the legendary White Wolf's doing in this cesspit. You're on vacation. I'm looking for the man responsible for Foltest's death. Here? I know the Scoyatel had a hand in it too. It's their trail I followed to Flotsam. Lucky you found Bernard Laredo then. If you're telling the truth, your vet's got raw blood on his hands. I can help you find him. What about Vernon Roach? Why didn't you let him in? Roach? Know the aura that surrounds him? Men like him act first and think later. And when they act, almost inevitably innocent blood flows. I trust you're on our side. Whose side is that? That of the people of Flotsam, of course. Terrorized by the elven bandits for years now. A local conflict, none of my business. You killed some elves on the riverbank outside Flotsam. I certainly we did. Attacked. You failed to mm. understand. It's you who doesn't understand, Lurido. To tell you the truth, I'm not human. You an elf? A dwarf? No, talking bollocks. I piss on the fact that they call you freak for your white hair and glowing eyes. You're a human like any other. We're fighting a war. And you, my friend, cannot straddle the fence. What about the elves and dwarves in the trading post? The smiths, peddlers, and hunters? They eat with you, sleep among you. Whose side are they on? Hell if I know. That's my point, Witcher. When you fight for survival, you need to be sure who your friends are. The non-humans in Flotsam, sure, they eat, fuck, shit among us. Mm. But when Yorveth sounds the battle horns, who knows what they'll do. They haven't proved their loyalty already, placing walls between Yorveth and themselves. They understand that bandit, Witcher. They share his language, his methods, his beliefs. We let them live among us, it's but like we the Japanese in World War II. One Crazy. night, they just might cut our throats and open the gates. Talk like that makes me sick. You're a witcher. Your job is to protect the simpletons from monsters. I protect them from the danger that lurks amongst the trees. I see where this is going. Yorvith's no better than a monster that attacks those who go out to gather kindling. Matter of fact, he's worse. He's smarter and crueler. How do we get him? I don't want you to kill him. Even you don't have a hope against his entire force. I have an idea, but I'd rather not go into it now. The squirrels are up to something. Every night their scouts come closer. I suspect they plan to attack the barge moored in the port. What's on the barge? You mean who? Bandits, murderers, rapists. On their way to the dungeons at Drakenborg. As soon as... Their infamous leader joins them. The cherry on the cake and Bernard Lorito's crown trophy. Couldn't have put it better myself. As long as Yorveth remains free, humans, elves, and dwarves will live alongside each other in deep distrust. I've got to learn what the pointy-eared rat is planning. How am I supposed to get that information? <laughs> you underestimate me, Witcher. True, I have my prejudices, but I'm not blinded by them. Take your friend Zoltan, for instance. He contacted Yorveth. How can Zoltan help if he can't go outside the walls? <laughs> step by step, Geralt. That's how you build trust. 
You could start by tending to a problem we have. A beast. The Kairin has yes, blocked all boat traffic. Lady told I'm me. losing I tolls, just kind of did this in the wrong order. The trading post is losing revenue. <clears throat> Kill the Kairin and I'll declare your friends acquitted of their crimes. Then Zoltan can take you to see Yorve. I'll see what I can find out. Now you stir up storms wherever you go. I actually believe you'll bring peace to Flotsam. Don't disappoint this town, Geralt. Farewell. All right. Oh, like some containers are locked. You need a key to open them. Don't mind me. Using my spidey senses to rob you. Only on the Commandant's express orders. Off you go. There we go. I think. <coughs> there we go. Finally outside. <laughs> Except a fireside feast with copious amounts of liquor. Greetings. <laughs> Add flour into the mix and it doesn't get any better. Huh? Luckily, the Commandant's provided it all. What do you need, ugly? What? Don't be mean. I wanted to surprise my friend, the sad-looking guy by the ballista. Some idiot wanted me to read him poems recently. Extravagance, as I say, <laughs> I didn't like it. I was thinking of something a little more traditional. What would you have me do? Just go with your specialty. All right. It'll be my standard rate. Draw him away from the ballista while you're at it. Slap me hard and call me stupid. Trying to put one by me? That'll cost you more. How's that? Surcharge on special requests. Those are the rules. Uh. Let me think it over. A favor for a favor? There is one thing you could do for me. And that is? Myron and Alphonse. Two of Laredo's thugs. Give him a good thrashing and I'll even blow... I stirred up enough trouble as it is during the execution. Uh. No need to stir trouble. Just humiliate them some ways. Consider it done. Myron and Alphonse. Teach them a lesson yet? Not just yet. <coughs> True. <laughs> Come here, lass. Your uncle's got a story for you. So long as he can I afford say to which... tell I'll not let an ear for less than ten orans. I don't like freaks. And I don't like oafish no necks. What do you want, mutant? To try my luck. Arm wrestling. It's oh my events. You, mutant. Save mm. the boasting till later. Let's do this. Mm. Nothing better than a fireside feast. <laughs> Except a fireside feast with copious amounts of liquor. Add flour into the mix and it oh my god, how do I do this? Luckily, the commandant's provided it all. True. <laughs> Come here, lass. Your uncle's got a story for you. So long as he can afford to tell it. I'll not lend an ear for less than ten orans. <laughs> Did it. I hate mutants like you. Sure. I know, I know. I haven't had this good a time in ages. Alright, so Myron's That's done. True. You know this one. I don't like strangers. Plamel, plamel. Along came a dwarf and kicked him in the ass. Plamel, plamel. Oh, you are a fat dude. You want to come? Plamel, plamel. Do that again, and I'll fuck you, ma'am. Plow them all. You've had your song. Don't you traipse around here. Huh. 
Who's the other guy? Byron and Alphonse. <laughs> Except a fireside feast with Sniffing copious amounts like of liquor. Sniffing around like dogs in a rubbish dump. <laughs> Add plowing to the mix and it doesn't get any better. Luckily, the commandant's provided it all. True. <laughs> Come here, lass. They say witches have no need to plow. Hmm. I don't think there was this guy yet. What you want, old man? Huh. I was looking to test my strength. Arm wrestling. No, I know what to do. What do I stand to gain? Nothing, because I'll thrash you. Uh. And if I win, you'll have beat a witcher. So I guess that gets you bragging rights. <coughs> Are you that good, old fella? The Grey Wolf? Yes. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's begin. <laughs> Nothing oh, better than a fireside feast. <laughs> Except a fireside feast with copious amounts of liquor. <laughs> Add plowing to the mix and it doesn't get any better. Luckily, the commandant's provided it all. True. <laughs> Come here, lass. Your uncle's got a story for you. So long Doom. as he can afford to tell it. I'll not lend an ear for Damn this. the dogs! The old man got me! <laughs> I need to eat. Build up a bit. Sure, sure. Yeah, totally. Hi, Margarita. Hmm. Makes me want a pizza. Myron and Alphonse. Teach them a lesson yet? Of course. All right. I'm off to give the boy some diversion. Nothing better than a fireside feast. <laughs> Except a fireside feast with copious amounts of liquor. <laughs> Add plowing to the mix and it doesn't get any better. Luckily, the commandant's provided it all. Here True. <laughs> Come here, lass. Mm. Your uncle's got a story, boy. Oh, come on. So long as he can afford Your to tell it. Are well at it I'll not lend fun. an ear for Would less than ten orans. All right, let's go. Haven't had this good a time in ages. That's true. You know this one. A little elf was skipping down the path. Plow all, plow them all. Along came a dwarf and kicked him in the arse. Plow them all, plow them all. Oh, you are a fat dirty rotten scum. Plow them all, plow them all. Do that again. Turned me away at the door, the bastard. Turned me away at the door, the bastard. Uh, don't close the door in my face, dude. Jeez, Louise. Have good, better manners, Roche. We'll meet later. Don't forget your weapons on the way out. <coughs> All right. So now, let me look at my journal here. All right. The way this is written kind of gives a little bit of, uh, you know, like it could be whether I learned from the dude, or from talking to a lady, Stick River. All right. Um. Let's see. The Claws of Madness. Haven't done that one yet. Necker Contract. Draw Trouble. Melina. Alright. Um, let's do Troll Trouble first, I think. Unless I'm on some kind of a timer in the game. Who am I supposed to talk to? Oh, I guess it doesn't give me a specific person to talk to. So I guess I'll make the mongoose potion. Hopefully it doesn't get me kicked out of town or something. Question his acquaintances. My acquaintances? Hmm.
Dandelion. Can I track him or something? So I think this is based on what I did in the first game and explains how I'm with Triss and being in this one. So it kind of like, whatever you did in the first one, who cares? Now you're with Triss. Um, let's see. I tell him, I'm taking your pal. My guys might be at the inn, I guess. Well, well, I had an inkling and it didn't disappoint me. It was a long voyage to this cesspit, but it's about to make sense. Voltest's killer, live and in person. How are you? Happy and healthy? Can't complain. I am delighted, really. But you see, it's a long way back to Vesima, hmm. and I'd rather not dawdle. Uh, I lost a load of time looking for I you. I think he can take no me on or something? waste any more talking then. Bon voyage. Listen, Jester. You're worth more to me alive, <coughs> but if need be, I will take you back as a corpse. You choose. All right. Give it a shot. Drop your sword and put your hands together, or I'll not vouch for what... Shut up. Go ahead. Try to kill me. Oh, I forgot my weapons before. Oh shit, 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 shit. I left my weapons behind. Roach did tell me. Yes, please. That's the game effing with you, huh? Makes you keep up your weapons and then tells you to get them back, and you gotta get them back. All right, gloves. Let's see. Armor. I've got our herbalist gloves. All right, let's see. All right, what I've got seems better than any of the stuff except for this one. Plus 11. Plus 11. Oh, okay, here we go. Plus two. Epic versus rare. <laughs> Alright, so... Let's get out of here. I'll have to find some of my stuff, too. Oh, these guys are waiting over here now, huh? This guy's taking a leak. That's funny. Oh, missed it. Alright, maybe if I walk this way now... You want to see me? I tell him. 
I'm taking your pouch. Or your pouch and your life. <laughs> Oh, there they are. The people that want to fight me. Bum bum bum. Alright, let's throw away some gloves. I don't need so many freaking gloves. I don't wanna I don't wanna die just because I couldn't move as fast as I needed to. Still over. Oh, it's only half a pound, huh? The fact that I pick up that was so big. Anyway. Yeah, Oh, cool. Let's do a whetstone. <sighs> yeah. Hmm, some junk, huh? Fire rope. Hopefully I don't need some later. Alright, whatever. Let's see what happens. Save. Got 20 minutes to use this stuff. Fortunately, it's on the wrong sword. Well, well. I had an inkling and it didn't disappoint me. It was a long voyage to this cesspit. Vulcan can hide no reason. Listen. All right. Drop your so Shut up. We've got a wonky ah. man here. <laughs> Grab him, boy. better this time. Just discarded some of that shit. Alright. See if we can find my frames. Troll trouble, troll troll trouble. These guys are still hanging, huh? Just don't try anything. Oh, because my sword's out. The sword stays sheathed. Understood. Still in a fight. Well, that doesn't make any sense. Alright, see if my friend's in here somewhere. Greetings. Alright, before I talk to them, let's talk to this guy. I get or not. Alright. Almost there. Don't need an extra hatchet. Alright, that gets me under the limit, so there we go. Talk to my friends. Good to see you, Zoltan. What are you doing so far from home? We already had this conversation. If life, Geralt, I'll tell you that much. You work your fingers to the bone for six years, you listen to the tirades of that old tyrant Breckenrig, you buy jewels. Then she breaks off the engagement. Huh. And there I was, learning like a vote. This narrative is broken. Out of sight, out of mind. 
Farewell to Yodora, the forge in Novigrad, and all the world's bracket rings. I'm a plain merchant, and I've made my peace with that. Can I ask you something, Zoltan? Sit down, Geralt, you old goat. Drinking alone is as bad as shitting in company. <laughs> Another time, maybe. You've been here a while and probably know the local customs. I'm no researcher, but go on, ask away. Who would need a troll's head? Same folks who need a bear's head to hang on the wall, mm. show how plucky they are. A peasant with a troll's head in his wall can raise many skulls. <laughs> Thanks. What are you off to? Sightseeing, round the houses of Lobenden. Right. So I think that tells me what I need to know about that. You gave Vernon a full report on Flotsam. Seen anything unusual around here? They've got some amazing women at the brothel. You should take a look. <laughs> One of them. You know what I mean. A town like any other. It's got a harbor, an inn, and a stinking muddy river. That's what an ordinary man would say. But we poets also look into people's souls. Oh, Dandelion. When things are not good, I saw a robbery sanctioned by law. Town watchmen laughing as they confiscated goods, all the while talking about how they'd finally bring order to the town. <laughs> I saw drunken thugs beat up an elf only while no one even flinched. I know these things happen everywhere, but here, it's not motivated by hatred or misguided attempts at meeting out justice. People are driven by cold calculation. They're always looking for opportunities to get a little richer. I need information. Anything that could help me track down the King Slayers. I only know gossip. Things folk have been saying since Demophen's death. People are throwing out blame left and right. One day it's the elves, another the Nilfgaardians, then it's Rivians. Let me guess. The suspects also include a Zeracanian alchemist and a group of halflings. Bold theory, that. But the mob comes up with even better ones. Know what? Frankly, the most worrying effect of these assassinations is the chaos they've unleashed in people's minds. What do you mean? I mean chaos. People don't know what to think, who's good and who's evil. And these are tough times. Who knows what's going to happen? Flashbacks, Dandelion. What have you remembered? My own death. I saw that with my own eyes, as I've told you many times. Yennefer gave her life to save yours. I thought you might have remembered what happened afterwards. I mean, how the devil can you be here now? I hear you, I see you, you're breathing. I, I mean, you're just alive. Dandelion, I've had a flashback or two. I don't know everything yet. All right, think. Well, let's see. So, Mr. Master Spy, what's new in the world of politics? Bards singing about anything interesting these days? Edern's in trouble. Henselt and his great army are nearing the Pontark and will ford it and strike any day. Wow, we haven't had a war in a long time. Like all little boys, he likes to play with his soldiers. But I don't think Kedwin will have an easy time of it. Edern's borders are guarded by Saskia the Dragon Slayer. Who's she? Some mercenary? A peasant girl and self-proclaimed commander of something called the Edernian Voluntary Militia. Fighting women and bards who played politics. These are strange times. Alright, let's try the top one. I know you. I can see you're dying to ask me. What is it? Alright, fess up. What happened to Foltest? Want to know the version that is yet to make it to Flotsam? The king died in mysterious circumstances. The Witcher Geralt, his sword covered in blood, was discovered standing over his corpse. Did you kill him? This will stay between us, I promise. The killer escaped before I could get him. I told you this already up. last so episode. Run around, yes, swinging it. your sword, hoping the killer walks into range? Mm. I don't have to. The killer's in the forest with the squads out, and he knows I'm here. We'll find each other. Geralt, please don't do anything stupid. Don't stick your neck out. If Lorito finds out you were involved in Foltest's assassination, Alright. So now if I go to journal. So I gotta look in people's houses, I guess.
Alright. Maybe locked at night. We'll see. Hmm. Wonder if I have to go systematically house to house. How the heck am I gonna know which ones which which ones I've done already? All that stuff. Hmm. Craftsman, craftsman. In in in. Shop. Well, there's not actually that many houses as long as I keep track of what I'm doing. Let's go ahead and make the potion. Let's see. to go in here or behind here? Let's see. Alright. Welcome. Oh wait, nope. The other side, I guess. Fortunately, I'm wasting time that my bullets would be awesome. Hmm. Oh, maybe because she's upstairs? Ever seen the river monster, the Karen? I have, but <coughs> I'm not the job that has carried. Speak up. A monster as big as a barn, with giant tentacles. Snatches men from boat decks and cattle off the shore. It's slimy like a snail, but fast as a thirsty vampire. I don't even know what that means. Don't know anything else. Okay, Ren, where are you? Birds. Dog catcher. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe I have to talk to her. Great 
Okay, through here. Yep, I'm trying to go upstairs. Oh, that guy's drunk. What's going on there? Not here. <coughs> Witcher, I've been awaiting you. We need to kill a monster that sinks boats. Afraid? No, but I suspect we'll need to draw it onto the shore. Leave that to me. I can't wait. I bet it's something spectacular. Hmm. Believe it. You'll do the honors. Huh. The honors? Once on the riverbank. You'll kill him. Her. Whatever I like it that. is. like Him. Her. Alchemists use troll tissue in their research, don't they? Troll eyes and tendons are potent ingredients. Useful in many potions. White Raffard experimented with their blood, claiming it had regenerative properties. He was wrong, <coughs> of course. Is there any reason an alchemist would want a troll's whole head? I don't think so. Unless he wanted a trophy. Hmm. Any progress? Did you find out where the Cairn came from? I didn't even try. So hmm. I take it you know it was created by a mage? I guessed as much. And what of it? Do you wish me to feel guilty, apologize for some madman? I don't intend to. How did you know it was a mage? Hmm. I didn't. Just guessed. Triss claims that Karen was born of magic. She's right. Something that large couldn't possibly evolve in the waters of the Pontar. It looks like the result of some botched experiment. It's growing rapidly and will probably age just as quickly. What's that? It looks impressive. A megascope. What does it do? Many complicated magical operations. It allows me to communicate with other sorceresses, oh, for cool. instance. Sorcerer Zoom. I never expected to see you at Laredo's. Whereas I was sure you would show up there. The Commandant is terribly jealous about his small trading post. Anyone of import is summoned to hear him out sooner <coughs> rather than later. What did he want from you? That is my concern, certainly none of yours. We're not a tandem, Geralt. We'll kill the Kran together, mm. but that is all. Okay. If we're going to work together... We should get to know each other. Is that so? Very well. Ask what you will. Are you and Triss friends? Friends? Colleagues, I'd say. Mm. Acquaintances, perhaps. I know all the sorceresses in the North. We aren't that many in number. Which is why we support one another. Sure. I'll be ready soon. I certainly hope so. And my question is, do I take it now? Do I take it later? I guess I take it now. Drink. Go, 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 go. Okay. All done. Time to go fight a monster. We got 10 minutes. Any progress? I've got everything I need. Let's go. Before we set out, you must make sure we'll get paid. Talk to the merchants by the warehouse. Really? God darn it. I had a feeling it was a bad thing for me to do. I guess the crisis ate away those 8,000 orans from the king. Got 
Ten minutes. That's terrible. Right, I guess I could try reloading a save. We'll see. Lads, I was thinking about what new boy. Maybe we ought to try some honest work from time to time. I always say this. I'll say it again. What do you want? Heard you have a problem. Ah, if only we had just one. <laughs> Highways washed out, forests full of bandits, a river beast blocks the port, and tolls are to rise. Can't help with the tolls, but the monster is a possibility. A sorceress said the same, but we've yet to see any results. She's asked me to work with her. And who's to pay your wage? That's you. what I'm here to discuss. You are. The sorceress was to manage alone. You can split that reward if you wish. Well, we're managing it together now. So as I see it, you should double the reward. <laughs> you jest! You'll double what you offered Lady de Tanzerville, because that's what the contract's worth. Well, that doesn't make any sense. So be it. Cool. I assume Love you're his Jedi mind professionals powers. and worth every last copper paid to you. It's a deal. Now tell me what you know about the beast. You're the Witcher, damn it! I've no <laughs> knowledge of these things. <laughs> Who could tell me more? That plowing elf, Cedric, oh. most probably. For Pete's He's sake, I'm not going to have any of this stuff by the time I'm done. Now leave me be. I knew I took it too early. We should commandeer a barge and sail to busy. All right, here we go. Let's talk to the lady. Seven minutes left. Uh, this way? No. Crap. Where did I come from before? This way. In the capital, who knows what we'd be? <laughs> Freaking sorcerers give me trouble. What's going on there? Dum, 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 dum. All right, here we go. Let's go kill this stupid thing. Where is she? There she is. Any progress? I've got it. Excellent. Finally. Ready. Are you wearing makeup? What? We all have our rituals. From what I know, K runs are colorblind. Enough, Geralt. Time to draw the beast out of the water. Got a nice <coughs> up your sleeve? I always do. Don't get eaten, and we'll soon both be heroes. Mm -hmm. I hope you're right. You descend into the lair. I'll stay on the bridge and pull it out onto the bank. Take care. It'll be extremely dangerous, even on land. Where the F is its lair? Oh, I gotta go all the way back out there again? God darn it. Okay, where is that? Again? What am I here? I feel like it's the wrong place to be. Oh, up there, I guess. Alright, so how do I get down there?
Hopefully I'm going the right way. No, I'm gonna have to save scum. this cutscene to start and I hadn't taken my potion yet, but I guess I did not do the right thing. Alright, hopefully pulled out the right sword. <laughs> Scary! I can push it back. Let's do a fire sign. Ow. Waited to tell me what was up till I was just about to die. Alright. Skip the cutscene. Alright. Erden. Ow. I get, I get back far enough. supposed to do. Alright. Why not? Just look up what in the world I'm supposed to be doing here, because I have no idea, and it's not fun to just keep dying over and over again. Uh... Uh, key ran. Yep, the key ran. Close. It will slam them and then use Erden. Alright, I will give that a shot and see what the heck happens. Because I have no idea. But first things first change to Yurden, 
second thing second. Head over here. Alright, let's see. Whoa. Maybe that's what I'm supposed to do. down it's angry watch out oh boy uh, it's not gonna be good for the bridge all right where's my cue oh right on the freaking head and I'm dead Maybe after I kill one of the tentacles, but who knows? Let's see. Darn it, gotta start all over again. Strength back. I don't know. Yo, boy. I can take or something. Alright, I think I'm getting very close to just giving up for today because I don't seem to be very good at attacking this guy. Oh, maybe I had the wrong sign on. This is my save. Okay, Erden. Oh boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
be the last time that I might need to sleep it off and come back or something. Alright, switch to Erden. See, he just hit me right away, man. What the heck? How many more can there be? Super Yurden. Whoa. Smack me back. Alright, stuck there, I guess. Make like a oh boy. Seems to be the most tentacles I can do. Try one last time. Hmm. Very annoying fight. The first I ever got in Witcher was the K-Ran, because the stupid thing annoyed the shit out of me. Starting off with the fact that I had the wrong sign. And I was using Yurden wrong. Whoa. Wonder how many more will turn up. Alright, at least I'm not as dead as I've been in the past. Get out of the way. Hero, get out of the way. Right, darn it. Whoa. Ouch. Get out of the way, Witcher! God darn it, out of the way! Oh boy. 
Did it work or not? It did, I guess. animation or what? Alright. So now I got a cube. Where is he? Okay. Oh, I think I got his tentacle, right? Did I? No. Alright, did I get him yet? Come on. What the hell? Come on, god darn it. Oh boy. Do the Yurdens closer? Can you tell where the hell I am? I should have got him. I don't know what I did in the beginning to get it to work, but it didn't work that time. Alright, I'm just gonna load it really quickly. Pause the game. See if I can figure out exactly what I'm supposed to be doing. You're in. Pause. so fast, I don't know what the hell I'm doing, so, let's see here. So what does this guy do? Oops, there's stuff in the way, here we go. Alright, hold on, let me go back here. Right here, let me see. 
there was something covering the words. I couldn't see what the heck they were saying here. Let's see. So they're saying on the side of the arena. I'm going to try to destroy that. I'm going to this first. All right. So it looks like I'm just, I guess he's just always slamming in the same place or something. So I just want to put my, whatchamacallit, um, See this, I feel like this guy's from an easier angle to see what's going on compared to me, but maybe he's just not moving in a dumb place. So he put one down. And he's just waiting for it to slam there. Alright. All right, if I was playing in dark mode, one hit kills you. Luckily, I'm not playing in dark mode. Um, so it seems like when the dude goes crazy, he's kind of just staying on the left side and not being slammed. So he got, he got slammed by the thing. He comes close, close, close. He ducks, puts a thing under it. And then waits for the last minute so it slams there. He seems to have a better camera angle than me, maybe. But let's see. Alright, I'm gonna try one last time now that I've seen this, I guess. Alright, so I'm gonna come over here, run, 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 run. Run, 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 run. Quen here. Hard right, right there. Whoops. Alright, so now I'm here. So at the last, there he goes. Now he's stuck. I come closer. Oop. I hope I come closer. God darn it, really? Alright, that was weird. <laughs> I'm not gonna count that. <laughs> that was just complete garbage. What was that? Didn't even get one tentacle. I guess they see why they say go for the leftmost tentacle. I thought that was the leftmost tentacle. How the hell was I supposed to know? He's getting late though, so. This is not my last attempt. It's gonna have to be like my second to last attempt. Unfortunately, after this part, which is not super easy for me anyway, um, I'm gonna have to do a quick time event, which I've not been doing all that great at. All right, let's just. Reload. Because I did not pick the right sign and I just started doing whatever random stuff. I wish I had picked the right sign to start. Now do a Q here, and then get out of the way, ouch. Oh boy. Alright. Oh, here it's mostly trying to sweep me. So I gotta go do one out here maybe. And try to see if he got trapped there, maybe. I can't see my enemy.
What the? I feel like I had better luck before I knew what the hell I was supposed to be doing. Me too. Come on. It's angry. Watch Got this pink thing on them. <laughs> shit, what's going on? <laughs> oh shit, go get all. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, one of them got stuck. Good. Dang. I still got a minute and 15 on that potion. Look at that. Yeah. We did it. Not a bad fight, wouldn't you say, Geralt? Are you all right? Yeah, it just took me a few lives. The beast got me a couple of times. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've heard you've been in more dire situations. I wonder, are the stories about you true? Depends what the stories are. What stories? If you think I'm going to repeat some of the legends circulating about you, you're deeply mistaken. What now? I must harvest the most valuable ingredients while the corpse is fresh. I'd prefer to get the entire carcass to my laboratory and strip it down to the bone. But that would be a waste of power and simply too much work. I shall take only... What have you heard about me? A number of things. You won't talk about them? 
I've no time now. The fresher the ingredients I collect, the higher the price I'll get. Sorry. Farewell then. Don't forget to collect the reward. Oh, I won't. Hmm. Level up. Better freaking level up, dude. Alright. Three talents. I can do these now, maybe? Let's see. Enhanced art sign. Enhanced axi. Quinn. All right. Or I could go alchemy. Okay. And I can come up here. Let's see swordsmanship. I like that one. Sure. All right, cool. Very neat. I like how it's represented here. Very cool. What is this? Oh, okay. Having seen uh, the Game Maker's Toolkit about tech trees, I wonder, is this a tech tree where I can get everything or is this a tech tree where I need to specialize? Is that? No, okay, that's just remnant from before. Press completed the Kiran. All right, collect your reward for slaying the Kiran. Okay, let's go to J. <laughs> the best rarity contract. If I go, oh, the other one's gone. Okay. So I've still got troll trouble. Still got Mystic River. I still got the Claws of Madness. I've still got a lot to do in this town. Okay. Right, I'm gonna start heading back to town. And then that'll be it for today. Oop, oh, pick herbs. Yes, always. It might be a few days till I play this again, so better to get to town than to try and remember the path to town later. Boy, I'm getting tired. Yeah, I gotta find a troll head somewhere. Hopefully I remember that. Looks like that's not something I find out there. Oh, this is where I got lost one time. I think it turned out that I just wasn't triggering the right spot to jump up. There we go. Alright, looks like I gotta veer off this way for a minute. Apparently caused by squirrels. Did you know that? Squirrels cause rain. All right. All right, almost there. Except this is the part where I mucked up last time. Like really, Geralt, you can't jump down a little bit. Uh oh. I've been by this thing before. 
Who's by me? Oh. Oh. Who? I just fought a giant octopus. You're nothing. giant mouth over there. Oh, scary. Oh, ouch. This guy's calling me buddies or something? Huh? I won't look at these things the same way next time in Quint. Time to get encumbered again. I imagine. Yep. I don't think I wanted to actually do that. Circle of endurance. If only I had activated that before my battle. Oh, another thing's coming. Ouch. I need to go this way. Got off the wrong path. I didn't mean it. I'm going the right way, am I not? Yes, okay. Generally speaking. I'm spending like days here, or at least a day so far. So yeah, I came in the back way. Hopefully there's an entrance or somewhere. those lanterns up there. It's pretty cool looking. Here I go, walking up towards the city. Hopefully I don't get ambushed. Uh oh! Speaking of ambushes. the game handles this stuff. Does it randomly generate them if I'm walking the woods too long? Does it... Are they walking around and then eventually they find me? Where the heck is the entrance to this freaking city, man? Here I am walking all slowly. It sure is pretty though. Oh, holy moly, look at that. Saw 
while I keep crawling down the, the ledge. That was really cool. Oh, there's another one crawling down the tree trunk over there. This is what I could have done with the octopus. There's just too much going on. It was too stressful. Alright, just want to get into the freaking city. There we go. Is someone fighting me? I guess there is, and that's why I can't get in yet. Oh, it's faded. There we go. Alright, now where to go? This way, I guess. A training dummy. Another training dummy. What? Oh, it's just him snoring. Better put my weapon away. See if I can collect my thing, be done with that, and save the game, go to bed. Ooh, look at my the reflections there. That's pretty cool. Man. I think I see the guy in there. Checking on barrels and whatnot. Yeah, cool pig. I think the stew's ready. Why it will Artist at work. You might want to stir it. Job done. The Karen's dead. Good work. You've earned your reward. Pretty cool glasses there. Alright. How much money do I have now? I should have checked how much money I had before. All right, I've got a sixteen twenty-seven. I got over a thousand bucks now. That's pretty good. A thousand orens. All right, I know it just auto-saved, but I'm gonna save too, just to be on the safe side. All right. So that's uh, Witcher there. Um. Yeah, that octopus was a bit challenging. Uh, so far. I don't know if it's because I picked easy mode or whatever, but the rest of the fights have been, you know, manageable. Not necessarily incredibly easy, but not, you know, where I would say they're causing me hardships where I have to run around like I did in Witcher 1. So that was uh, kind of annoying with that octopus, but, uh, you know, it, it K-Ran, whatever, it is what it is. Um, so, yeah, as I said before, um, if you happen to catch this on Twitch, um, I probably won't be uh, live streaming Witcher for a while, but, uh, you can catch episodes on uh, when they archive up in uh, YouTube. Um, it's probably going to be sometime around September. I've got a long queue of games going that I've been playing over time. Um, but whenever I can, I'll come back here and live stream some more. And uh, according to... Twitch stats from OBS. I've got a viewer. I don't know if I literally do. The person hasn't been talking, which is fine. You know, lurkers welcome here. Don't have to talk. Um, but uh, yeah, so there's that. Um, I'm so tired. I can't remember. This has been Eric playing The Witcher 2. I'll see you next time. Bye.